Inside a heavily traveled bridge over the Swamp Rabbit Trail in Greenville will soon be closed for emergency construction. 7 News' Asia Wilson tells us why it's happening and what to expect. The South Carolina Department of Transportation says the bridge was deteriorating and now a weight limit has been implemented and construction is on its way. Whether it's in cars, on bikes, or on foot, McDaniel Avenue is a hot spot for commuters in Greenville. It's a big cut through for a lot of people. Along that busy stretch of road, something was recently discovered by the South Carolina Department of Transportation. Discovered that some of the steel beams and the girders in the bridge were starting to corrode and that they were having concerns. Now SCDOT is in the process of starting construction to fix the problems. Some walkers saying it's a positive thing. I think it's a good idea. I think it's for a safety measure, so I think that um, new and better is always good. As the extensive corrosion is being fixed, SCDOT has lowered the weight limit to a three-ton maximum. Which means vehicles larger than an SUV are advised to not drive over it. School buses aren't driving over the bridge, fire trucks. I think that could be a concern, but I would hope that the you know the city planners and folks would have that figured out. The city says a detour route is already in place, taking people off McDaniel Avenue onto Richland Drive, onto Cleveland Street, and back again. In addition to DOT doing the bridge repairs, the city will be looking to improve the sewer line that runs through there and also potentially add you know, some improvements to the Swamp Rabbit Trail. The city says in the meantime, no one needs to be concerned about the safety of the bridge. Uh, DOT is coming out regularly to ensure the safety of the bridge. So I don't know if people need to imminently worry. Which some feel is music to their ears. I think it's definitely worth getting it fixed. We don't want any cars falling down. Right now, South Carolina DOT says they're in the process of completing design plans and selecting a contractor to do the work, and then construction will begin immediately. In Greenville, Asia Wilson, 7 News. DOT says once the construction does start, they're expecting the bridge to be finished late spring or early summer.